What's up guys, my name is Stefan and we're back to Coral Reefs. We are back with an episode of Coral Reefs and today's episode is episode 47. And in today's episode I want to make a treasure pile. First of all I need to grab my treasures, aka my diamonds, gold, redstone, lapis, whatever treasures I have. So the treasure pile is going to be located over here. And it's going to be like a nice decoration. So I'm going to start placing blocks randomly and see what it will turn out to be. I do have a lot of coal blocks which I don't really want. So I'm going to use them as a base. I'm going to put some lapis blocks of course. Like I need to switch all of my blocks into treasure blocks, I guess you could say. And uh, let's start building. Ooh, I like the emerald texture. It looks cool. You know, put some diamonds here and there. I have even more redstone than I have coal, so I'm going to use that as a base too. Put a lapis block here and there. Some gold blocks, why not? And the rest of it, let it be coal. So, this... I guess treasure pile is going to be here until the end of the series and it will live on into my memory as all the treasure I I had and I don't have any more so I hope if somebody finds this they will have good use for it because I don't I'm just placing it randomly into the open for people to steal. I wish that there were like robbers and stuff. It would be it would have it would have been really awesome to like fight off some robbers to protect your riches, but there isn't and I don't really like that. Maybe there's some mod for it, but this is a vanilla server. Actually, this is a vanilla world. It's not even a server. And no such thing exists. So this pile, I guess you could say, is going to contain not all my riches. It's going to contain some of my riches. I should have probably put it closer to my house, but it's okay. It's close, close enough. So I don't have that many emerald blocks left, but I do have tons of coal blocks. So I'm going to start pillaring upwards and see what it will turn out out of this monstrosity. So, is this like enough? <laughs> it's... Well, I don't really like that it's not going over here. So I'm going to make it spill over. Put more variety of blocks here. I didn't realize that I had this much blocks until now. Like, it's a lot. And there are plenty of more iron ingots into the iron farm which are going to be left unused and the last few iron blocks here and I guess a few redstone and lapis blocks and that is it this is the <laughs> the treasure pile so whoever finds it it will be lucky it looks a lot it looks like a lot I know but I wanna use it for something I won't like, I don't use my treasures a lot, which I should start using. I don't know, I'm kind of stingy like that. Now I want to try the Elytra course because I haven't tried the Elytra course in a while and I still suck at flying the Elytra. But I want to try. So if I run up here and jump and activate my Elytra, I go down, then I should pass. Nope, skip that one, I guess. I go down here, then I do this. I'm, I'm not able to reach that one. I should just lower that. Next thing on my agenda is to build the space station. So the space station is going to be built out of glass, some stone slabs, smooth stone. I might even put some colored concrete to mark it as mine. But it will be like a simple build. It will have a lot of glass included, even though that's not really safe to have glass on a space station. But who cares, it's Minecraft. So now I'm going to fly to the space station, which is up high in the sky. I... Oh, I see it, actually. I don't know if one rocket is enough to... Nope, it's not. Two rockets, and I'm up here. Good. So I'm building the walls three high. 
whoops, my mistake. And then I'm going to make him like half spheres. The bottom part, I guess, it's missing. I don't know what I'm going to do with the paths and stuff. But they're good. So now I'm going to build this. And I guess enjoy this third person time lapse. So, hopefully you enjoyed that third person time lapse, and now it is time to make a water elevator. So I'm going to grab my water elevator making tools, and basically just my kelp, some blocks, and um, a block of soul sand. So I should have a block of soul sand somewhere. Here's the soul sand, I think I'm going to make it out of uh, glass panes. I do have some glass panes too. And I'll need a bucket of water and of course I'm going to need kelp so I'm going to grab my kelp which is in the kelp farm I don't think that I have enough though I'm going to check quickly because it's around 
hundred and something blocks in the sky from the surface. And I might have enough, but I'm not sure. So I'm going to start making the water ele elevator once I get out from here. So I'm out finally. And now I fly down here. I have the coordinates written down. So I'm going to go somewhere close, like near the rocket. And I'm going to see the coordinates. 268343. 268343. So 26, okay. 268343. Three. I'm going in this direction. Come on, 343. Three. And 268. So here. Now am I. I think I'm right, hopefully. So this will be the elevator. Oh my gosh, that will be hard to build. No, 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 no. Now I'm going to do this the whole day, I guess, and I'm going to make a water elevator. So I'm going to put the water down so that it will be easier for me to climb up and down. I actually won't have to connect the sides because it looks better without it. It kind of looks like the water is just there. It's not like a casing like it's with the cloud. I'm not sure. I'll see how it looks and whoops, that's a mistake that shouldn't have been made. So how many blocks more? Come on. Now imagine if I'm wrong. Whew, I'm not wrong. <laughs> Thank you, something I made right. Okay, now I, I don't know, like to here, and then I'm going to put the water here, I don't want to waterlock the glass pane, and now, whoops, nope, okay, so the water should fall down, and he just stole a block, I saw you, Enderman. Now, come on, is the water actually falling down? I, I have no idea. So, I'm going to... Nope, can you not? Oh my gosh. Can you stop that? Thank you. Yep, the water is here. Like, Do I really need to have sources? Water sources, blocks, whatever. Come on, please work. I guess I need sources. No, 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 that's bad. Can I actually place... Uh, can you stop doing that? Can I place kelp on top of... I can't. So, I guess I'm going to have to do that. Oh, please, just stop attacking me. Okay. Can I actually climb the freaking thing? Nope, I can't. Am I going to die from fall damage? Yes, I am. Why? Because I'm stupid. Finally, I'm, I'm up here. So, I'm going to build this and see you with the kelp pudding thing process. So, here's the thing all built. Now, it is time to put the kelp in. And after that, add the soul sand and hopefully I'll have myself a working water elevator. Now I hope that I have enough kelp to actually reach the top. If I don't, then I am screwed. I'll have to go into the ocean, harvest some kelp and continue what I started. And guess what, I don't have enough by a lot. But lucky me, there is a lot of kelp here, and hopefully now this will be enough to finish what I started with the water elevator. Now if I, come on, if I go into the water stream, I should just be able to climb up. And then I should start putting kelp back, then I'm going to jump down at the soul sand, and I should have a working water elevator. So here I am, putting kelp and like how many blocks is this like two stacks plus okay last few blocks good so the kelp is all here 
now if I activate my elytra and I land safely and if I put now the soul sand over here so where's the soul sand if I put the soul sand here this should all yep it is all converting into a water elevator it's a really fast one I can see a lot of kelp flying down here that's good bad whatever but this is a freaking fast water elevator and I love it. So I'm going to end this episode here guys. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and also share it with your friends. Subscribe over there, check the last video out over there. And my name is Stefan and I'll see you all later. Bye! Stay strong.